well, you know, speaking of Einstein in particular and some of his music, it, it denies the, the demand for resolution, for satisfaction. It's not going to just tell you what it's about. But it's, it's really, you know, can you give yourself as a listener, as an audience member, to the possibility offered by these experiences in a way that offer the opportunity for this sort of transformation of your own consciousness is, is I guess, the question that these artists are asking. In 1837, Emerson writes a piece called The American Scholar, and he delivers it to the graduating class of Harvard University. And he says, there are as yet no American scholars, none whatsoever, he says, because the newness of America, its template of experiment, its Monroe Doctrine, fantasized as the destiny over land and peoples therein. A vast new future was as yet uncreated, and that the task of the American thinker was to bring into being a new form of thinking adequate to the American experience. Frederick Jackson Turner <laughs> writes a book about the American frontier, the great historian of his generation, which he says that because the settling of land is complete, the American spirit will degenerate. We require experiment, at which point the American movies are born and the Western comes into being to pick up the idea of the renegade, which is John Wayne and Clint Eastwood. And the idea of a renegade, therefore, in the construction of America, is the idea of somebody who refuses the templates of Europe so that they may be free to imagine an America in which they don't live and don't want to live there.